Hey, Dustin Hawksmith and Jeremy Elliott, your fantasy football insiders for PennLive.com. Breaking down another backfield in fantasy for week three. We're looking at Minnesota now. Adrian Peterson, a torn meniscus in his right knee. A tough injury, a tough timetable to try and figure out when or if he will be back. He's got some choices to make in his recovery. I tend to suspect that he will try to take a shortcut to get on the field as fast as possible. I doubt that he'll be there for week three. That's just my hunch right now, which would leave Matt Asiata and Jarek McKinnon as your two choices. We've seen this situation unfold before in 2014 when Peterson was sidelined because of a suspension. Asiata got a bulk of the work. McKinnon was better in smaller doses. Asiata was the goal line guy. McKinnon was the PPR guy. So take your pick. I'm taking Jarek McKinnon because of that PPR explosion that he can give you. He can also take it the distance. He can turn a you know 10 yard gain into a 50 yard touchdown in a hurry. I know Asiata is one of those guys that can get you four carries for three yards and two touchdowns, but I think Jarek McKinnon right now has to be your play. He's seen action, more action this year, and I think he probably knows the offense and will uh, be a better fit with Sam Bradford. I think the question is, what are you trying to accomplish here? Are you looking for a top 35 running back on a week-to-week basis, maybe with Adrian Peterson out? That's your get, what you're getting from Asiata. You have potential for more from McKinnon. I tend to lean that route just as an upside seeker, stash McKinnon at the end of your bench, especially in PPR formats. You could be sneaky good for a couple weeks anyway. That's Jeremy Elliott. I'm Dustin Hawkins with your Fantasy Football Insiders for PennLive.com.